Hi, today we are going to see demo for scholarship management PHP web application. So first open the ZAM control panel. Start the Apache and MySQL. Then click on the MySQL admin. Left side you can able to see the backend database on these tables. Then go to the Visual Studio. First explore the Spanish folder. Then go to the document. This is the project full documentation. Then you can see the addressing files and source code. Next go to the readme text. Here you can see the login details and URL link. Copy the URL link and paste to the browser. Now we can see the scholarship web application. It have three roles, user, staff and admin login. First go to the user login. We have to sign up. Go to the user register. Enter our register here. Enter our name, email id, then password. Give your mobile number. <laughs> then click on the register. Your password must contain at least one capital letter and special character. Then length of 8 digit. Now click on the register. Register successfully. If you already register, you can use your email ID and password. Then log in into the user home page. Now you can see the user home page. User will be apply the scholarship scheme and see the officer's approval status. First go to the approval scheme. Here you can see the scholarship schemes on schemes on this page and then click on the apply. Here you can see the procured documents and go to the apply. Then you can see where my application. Here you will be first see the approval status. Approval status will be bending. So you will be upload your documents. Click on the image, then choose the file. First, upload the certificate. Then upload the student ID card. Next, upload your author card. Finally, upload your income tax card. Now, upload successfully. Next, go to the feedback. Here, you will be share our feedback on this page. Then, my profile is used to update your contact details. Next, we will move for the admin. Enter the email ID and password. This is the admin home page. Admin will be create the scholarship schemes and update. Then, admin can add the officers and to manage the student details. First, go to the create scheme. Here you will be add the scholarship schemes on this page. So give the scholarship details, then click on the submit. After you add the schemes, go to the update scheme. Here you will be see the all schemes and you will update and delete the 
scholarship schemes details then go to the create officer here you can add the officers on this page so enter the officer's name then email id then enter the password and mobile number give the location and college name next go to the student details here you can see the all student all scholarship school and reports on this page Next go to the student details. Here you can see the all scholarship student reports on this page. Next go to the application. Here you can see the all student applications and then see the certificates. Next you will give the approval on this page. Click on the update and then give the approval. Then give your command. Next click on the update. Now update successfully. Now you can give the approval on this scholarship. Next go to the feedback. Here you can see the student feedback on this page. Next we will move for the staff login. Enter the email id and password. Then login into the staff home page. Now login successfully. It's our three modules. Staff will be see the scholarship and approve the student scholarship. So first go to the application. Here you can see the student applications and then check to give the approval. Officer first give the approval, then staff will be give the approval. Next go to the services. Here you can see the all scholarship schemes on this page. Next go to the report. Here you can see the total number of application status reports on this page. That's the whole scholarship management PHP web application. Code shopping.